Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. And a very sweet and vanilla welcome all. I am expecting everybody's awesome and blessed health. And uh, I was not present yesterday because I went to Bajor. I had some work and uh, I enjoyed my time over there as well, I must say. And yes, uh, the weather was moderate there. Like when I came back to Peshawar, it's so hot. But in Bajo, it was moderate, believe me. And besides that, I went to a spring, a Cheshma. You know Cheshma? Uh, by the name Gabarchina. Gabarchina. Uh, it was so cool. Believe me, it was so cool that I was shivering inside the water, inside that spring, and in, inside that Cheshma. And you know that we call it Gabar uh, China uh, because there was a, an emperor by the name Sultan. So Sultan defeated this area, the entire Barsaghir at that time. It was uh, Pakistan, it was by Pakistan was not available, the India was not available. So at that time, Sultan defeated that area and killed everybody over there and made and made what? The building of skulls. You know, made the building of skulls, Kopri skulls, you know, this head. Like he was cutting the head and making the tower of it, the Gabarchina. Clear? So I went to that place, there was a spring and the, the water was so pure, uh, so clean and cool. Oh my God, believe me. If you would have entered to this area, so you wouldn't leave that spring. There, there was that much awesome there because it was at the top of the mountain, very at the peak of the mountain. It was, we were at the top of the mountains. So I went there, I had some work. So my friends over there said, let me take you to the Gabarchina. It was my second time that I have visited this Bajawar, Guluna, we call it, the Bajawar flowers. Okay, and besides that, uh, that's all, yes. And uh, today I'm in Peshawar with you people. And if you have something, good news, bad news, anything, so please share. Nothing? Okay. Yes, I enjoyed. So let's, okay, let me ask from uh, Mariam, what is your favorite color? Assalamu alaikum, sir. Uh, my favorite color is white and black. White and black. Okay, we cannot use white, but we will use black today. Okay. The first word that I have for you is, okay, uh, let me give you two words. One is going to be positive. The second is going to be negative. Now you don't know the meaning, but you have to select one. Then I will tell you the meaning. Now it depends on you. Okay, so directly you have to choose the words. The first one is cynic. Okay, the first one is cynic. The second word is beseech. Now which one do you like? Come on, select everyone. Do you like cynic word or do you like beseech word? Sir, beseech. Okay, fine. I hope you all select it, okay? You all select it. Okay, now let me tell you, those people who have selected the cynic, so it means, cynic means, oh, let me tell you, backbiter. Cynic means backbiter. You know, backbiter is a very negative word. In Urdu, we are saying chugal khur. In Pashtu, in Pashtu, we are also saying chugal khuri kawal. Right? So now, Mr. Uh, Farhan selected the beseech. Now, what is your beseech? Beseech means implore. Implore means minnat karna. Minnat kawal. To minnat kiyo kasnata so. It means you are beseeching. 
Okay, actually both the words were negative. You know, beseeching is good in some way, but not always. Beseeching is good if you are beseeching from a scholar, from your mother, from your father. But if you are beseeching for uh, <clears throat> such things which are not good for you, then beseeching is completely not uh, good for anyone. Clear for anyone. Then the third, which is connected to cynic, which is called hypocrite. Hypocrite means munafik. Now, what is munafik? Uh, munafik is somebody is saying something from the tongue, but inside the heart, he or she is making it very bad, very hate. That person is called what? Cynic. No. They can, uh, yeah, like, Minnat karna means to do request nahi hota. Like when if you are requesting, like I can request from all of you. But minnat karna, bar bar minnat means you are considering yourself less and asking for something. That is minnat. All right, sir. Now, now I understand. Minnat kise kehte? Minnat khud ko kam tar samajna. Allo ke hath is tarah big mangna. Ye logo se kuch mangna. That is called minnat. Minnat matlab tizan. Request is something, it's a very nice word, request is. Now, a hypocrite. Hypocrite means what? Like, you know, Allah, it's one of the, Allah doesn't like those people, like some guests came to somebody's home or a house after that guests are gone, so the host or the hostess is saying something bad against the guest. That is hypocrisy. That is munafakat. That is completely illiteracy, jahalat. At the time of Prophet Muhammad, there were lots of hypocrites who are saying to Prophet, yes, we are with you. But at the time of the trial, trial means azmaish. Trial means azmaish, imtihanat. Azmaish. At the time of trial, those hypocrites were going back. Okay? Like, if whatever is coming to your heart, please bring it to your tongue. It's my request from everyone. That is with your uncle, with your friends, with your relatives, bring it to your heart, bring it to your tongue. It's very bad, okay? And the last word for it is that, that is count beats. Count beats means uh, to count the blessings of Allah by astaghfar, astaghfar, by La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah, by Allah Akbar, Allah Akbar, by Hasbun Allah wa Ni'mal Wakil, Hasbun Allah wa Ni'mal Wakil, by saying, I was by saying, Bismillah, Bismillah. You know, there are lots of uh, blessings of Allah you can do count beats. In simple Urdu, we are saying, Tazbi karna. In Pashto, we are saying, Tazbi kawal. Like some people are saying, Astaghfirullah, Astaghfirullah, Astaghfirullah. Some people, you know, there are lots of people are doing lots of things. You know, there are lots of count beats. Like my favorite one is Astaghfirullah and Hasbunallah wa ni'mal wakil. Astaghfirullah means forgive my sins. Hasbunallah wa ni'mal means make the difficult times easier for me. Okay, so if you have a question, you can ask me, please. Sir, the cynic means ghibat. Yes, ghibat. Ghibat to you, chul khuri to you. Malab ghibat and chul khuri, that's your shanti dino. Ghibat to you, chul khuri to you, but both are equal, both are same. Okay, so no question? Fine. 
So, sir. Yes. Cynic means. Sir, uh, repeat again. Repeat again. Okay, I will repeat again. Uh, cynic means ghabat karna, etchugal khuri karna, deceit me, minnat karna, hepukare munafiqat, trial, azmaish ya imtihan, kaun beats, tasbi karna, tasbi karna, stara, laila lunda, laila lunda, stafula, stafula, tasbi karna, right? Okay, so I will not ask for the examples. Okay, my examples can be pushing. We have to speed up the activity sheets. So here I am sharing the activity sheet. So we were in which unit? Can anybody can tell me? We are in unit seven or six. Okay, so this is then right. Okay, now this one we are supposed to do. Okay. Match the sentences, then listen and check your answers. Are all the requests reasonable? Reasonable means jais. There are some requests here one, two, three, four, and five. Request number one and request number two. Wali, read the request number one and Ahmad, give the response to request number one. Now you can give the response with the help of A, B, C, D, E, for example. Would you take your garbage out, please? Now, which request is possible? Which answer is possible? The walls are really thin, so the sound, which one? It often comes, we don't want strangers. I need a part-time online. It can attract insects. Which one is the correct answer for this request? Yes, please. Would you mind not parking your car in my parking space? Can you kindly repeat it? Uh, would you mind not parking your car in my parking space? Uh, now, sir, I have to give answer. Yes, what do you think? Which um, answer is possible here? A, B, C, D, or E? Mm. E. D. E. I, I need to park mine there. Kanzul and Mariam, two. Yes, sir, I asked from like question number two, not from number one. Okay, ask number two, Wally, from Ahmad. Uh, sir, first I ask, ask, I ask, ask him like from number two, now I will ask him number one. Okay, Ahmad, can you uh, ask request number two? Yes, sir. Would you mind not parking your car in my, in my parking space? I need to park mine there, like number E. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Would you yeah, take your that, garbage okay. out? Oh, yes, yes, yes. I didn't notice. Sorry. Uh, would you take your garbage out? So which one is the right? It can? It can attract insects. Yes. Now, number two is with E1. Number E. Okay. Kanzul and Mariam, three. Uh, uh, would you mind turning the music down, please? Uh, D, the ones are really thin, so the sound uh, goes through to my apartment. Okay, Zia and Farhan. Marshall, which one? Number four. four? Yes. I will ask. Yes, Farhan, you respond. Farhan is disconnected. How should you respond? 
Could you close the door behind you and make sure it locked? We don't was take to enter the building. Strangers. Can you keep your cat inside, please? It often comes into my path through the balcony. Now, let's come. Look at the request again. Have you ever made similar requests? Okay. Have you made any one of them in your life? Yes, I often make this request. Could you please close the door behind you and make sure it locks? I often do this, uh, the, uh, this request. So anybody who is having these requests in your daily life? Uh, sir, I think, would you mind turning the music down? I think uh, this one. Okay. Sir, I do these requests daily to my brother, but he just don't listen to me. He ignore me and go away. Okay, Ahmad, you should listen. Okay, you should take out the garbage. Sir, I, Ahmad, I, I, uh, I do this, uh, these requests, some of these in daily, like, uh, like my about uh it something it, uh, something comes to uh, my balcony to another apartment balcony from the wind so i just uh, and uh, when uh, i am in a room so when i ask somebody or my little brother to close the door even if it, it is locked and so it, it is locked but my little brother just, just ignore me and go away. Okay. Fine. Now, please me promise karna, wada karna. Promise. Solemn. Promise or you can also get solemn. Now, let's come to the request. How can we have requests in our life? how to request or how to ask for request in english how you can ask for request in english so if you like to ask for request in english so there are multiple options option number one you can have requests with the help of can you please can you please open the door can you please close the door? Can you please pick up the trash? Can you please turn on the light? Can you please blah, blah, and blah? Quite. You can have the request with the help of, could you please? Sorry, sorry we have a problem. Uh, Farhan, I have no problem. I think your connection is a bit weaker. So you can have, could you please with the help of, and as well as you can have requests with the help of, would you please? Sir, please. sorry, I have connection problem. Yes, maybe it seems like that. So you can have requests with any of them with any of them. Suppose, let's come to number one. Uh, can you please turn on the TV is equal to, could you please turn on the TV? Equal to, would you please, would you please turn on the TV. They all have the same meaning. Can you please turn on the TV? Could you please turn on the TV? Would you please turn on the TV? Now, how can you respond? How will you provide the answers? You can provide with the elbow will. What? Will. Like how? Yes. I will. I will is equal to I. 
<coughs> yes, I will. Yes, I will. Right? Or you can also say, Sean, would you please turn on the TV? <coughs> sure. Or you can also say, no problem. Or you can say, I'll do it. Clear? If you want to accept the request, sure, I'll do it. Now, if you are busy or you cannot do it, so you can say, I'm sorry, but I am busy. I'm sorry, but I'm busy. You can request like this. Now, in the same case, you can have requests with the help of would you mind plus gerund? What is gerund? First word plus ing. First word plus ing is called gerund. For example, how you can say? You can say over here, go ing going, sleep sleeping, eat eating, come coming. Right, writing, these are gerunds. When you use ing with the first word, that is called gerund. You can have requests with the above this as well. Like how? Look at here. I said, can you please turn on the TV? I will say here, would you mind turn ing? Turning on the TV. Turning on the TV. Clear? For example, can you please open the door? I will say here, would you mind opening the door? If you say only, would you please, then you'll use the word only first. So for example, would you please open the door? But if you use mind, if you use mind, then you'll use the first place ing. If you do not use mind, then you only use the first rule, like over here, would you please open the door? Clear? Or if I say, would you mind closing the gate? But if I say, would you please close the gate? Clear? Now, remember, always remember, always remember, Khafa Hona. Always remember, always remember, if I am saying over here, look, mind means to become sad. Mind is khafa hona, khafa ki dil. If you are saying, would you mind turning on the TV? If you say yes, it means you are saying no. Did you understand? If I say, would you mind turning on the TV? You are saying yes. It means you rejected the request. You what? You rejected the request here. It means in Urdu, kya ap khafa honge darwaza band karne se? Aapne kaha, ji ha. It means aapne request ko mana kar diya. If I say, tasubha khafa ki gichi darwaza band ki? If you say yes, tasubha ao. But love request, tasubha mana ke lehi. Right? But, if you are saying no, it means you accepted the request. For example, would you mind turning on the TV? No, it means yes, you accepted the request. Only in the case of mind. Mind means to, be, to feel sad. Any question, please? No, sir. Okay. Sir, I am disconnected. If you are disconnected, so brother, it's very long. Please check the recording because I have to stop from the very basic. What do you mean by gerund? Gerund means first word plus ing is called gerund. For example, if you are using ing with the first word, that is called gerund. If you are saying, for example, speak, put ing speaking, Jaren, sit, put ing sitting, right? 
for example, tell, put ing telling, these are gerunds. Clear, Hashir? And the rest, please check the recording. Now, let's go to the over here, models. Request with models and would you mind? Models means can, could, would, these are models, okay? Can you keep your cat inside, please? Could you turn the music down, please? Would you please park your car in your space? Would you mind keeping your cat inside? Look, it becomes keeping. Would you mind turning the music down, please? Look, turning, mind. Would you mind not parking your car in my space? Now look at the requests here, and these are the responses. These are the requests, and these are the responses. So come on, please, everybody, uh, you should participate over here. So Zia and Ahmad, sorry, Ahmad is disconnected. Zia and Wali. Zia, request number one and request number two. Have the these two requests from Wali and Wali response according to these. Yes, please. The first one and second? Yes. Uh, would you mind not using your phone in class? What you brought in? Excuse me, sir. Yes. They were just far away. I just, could you please uh, tell me what I have to do? Okay. Uh, these are the requests and you have to respond. Mm -hmm. Which one is the correct response to these requests? Okay. He asked number one. Okay. Yes, Sorry, we asked. didn't know. We, we were so loud. Uh, would you mind not using your phone in class? Sorry. Okay. Sorry, I had to talk with my boss. Zia number two. Zia number two. Okay, Farhan, you ask 